Again, I think the starter stage is Dreamland, and then there's like a bunch of counter picks. Uh, but I don't really know if a lot of people are gonna do that. It's like a 64 player psychology thing. I think, like, we're not used to running big stage lists, and when you see like 20 stages and DSR and stage striking, a lot of people are just like, hey, you wanna play Dreamland only? Like we usually do? But then at the same time, there's there's definitely some people in this bracket like uh, like Bark or Dogs who will probably just ban Dreamland at every available opportunity because they want to try more stages. <laughs> you do that too. All right, so we're <laughs> we're getting Kirby against Wario here. Actually, not a bad matchup for Wario. I don't think he does kind of struggle to get in, but he can punish Kirby pretty hard. Does the get-up attack there twice in a row. That should never hit it so bad. Let's see if we can get an edge guard on Kirby. <laughs> oh! I thought Closin was gonna die there. So I'm actually uh, not familiar with player two here, Nikki T. I've never played with them before, seen them around. So I don't really know what to expect from this player. I don't know how good they are. <laughs> Closin just Ford smash spamming across the stage. Doesn't care. I think this is uh this is one of the two winners around one matches in this tournament, so these are some like low seated players. And uh Nikki T's entered the tournament here and run into the most troll Kirby in the universe round one. <laughs> he's also yeah, he's from the West Coast, so he's probably playing on like four frames or something or maybe more if it's like Chicago <laughs> goes for the inhale it would be kind of interesting to see him I think he wants to get Wario's power and maybe do some yaz of his own uh, but Nikki T manages to get the kill there keeping it somewhat close Closin is definitely just fishing for that inhale it looks like he wants to steal the power <laughs> oh my god Wait, he just spits- he, that's what he wanted, okay. He does the classic Klosenberg cheese. I guess if you're there, you might as well shoot him off, right? <laughs> this is a little bit rude from Klosenberg, I have to say. Just doing <laughs> doing these neutral bees at all times. Does get a little bit of a combo there. And... Oh, yep, he takes the power, got his, got his little yellow hat on now. And I think it... <laughs> He's just gonna, yep. You can see that one coming from a mile away. Oh, but Nikki T turns it around on him, and then jumps into the up B. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that was so good until it wasn't. Klosenberg got the ultimate taste of his own medicine. Set count updated. I'm a real tournament streamer now. Alright, so they are gonna go back to Dreamland, and uh, Nikki T is gonna pull out the fox, possibly a vanilla main here. Don't really know. We'll see what Klosenberg can do against a fox, though. Fox against Kirby is kind of a hard matchup, uh, especially if you're not like super proficient. Like, you gotta really be super careful, space your hits far away, not get hit by an up air like that. That's just so sad. Kirby's up air has like that super high set knockback, and Fox got caught by it after a double jump. That's just like an immediate kill. You can't really do anything to stop that. Unless the Kirby like messes their edge guard up. You can see up tilt though, but not a big punish off of that. That's the kind of thing you gotta be uh, on point with those things if you're fighting Kirby with Fox. Missing the Z cancel. And Klosen just barely misses his up B. Klosenberg really loves going for those up Bs. Um, he's definitely in that school of players who uh, prefers to just do whatever the heck they want and not try to play optimal. He just wants to up B you and spike you and possibly inhale you as well. <laughs> oh, that could have been an up smash there for Nikki, but I think maybe missed the, the dash after landing, got a walk instead. So wasn't able to close that gap. 
And now Closin is using the laser. He's just giving us a full showcase of all the different hats Kirby can wear. Let's see, <laughs> we'll see if he can do anything with it. He's gonna just shoot it at a uh, dead fox a couple times for the disrespect. I like to see like a up tilt to laser or something. Gets him with the rock now, and he's just gonna shoot a grounded laser that does absolutely nothing and get himself killed by an upper. Okay. <laughs> Not the best play from closing there, but he does have a pretty big lead. Let's we'll see if he uh, decides to go for another inhale and get that laser back again. I sense an up B coming, and it connects. If you're not ready for that, like, if you're a new player, that up B gimmick can be really hard to deal with. It's got like a huge hitbox that beats everything, and it kills you at any percentage. Uh, and on top of that, like, a really common habit... Uh, for pretty much all players, but new players especially, as Cloven Closin almost gets that kill, is to double jump back towards the stage just like immediately out of hit stun. Gets the upper though, manages to get the kill. So Closin really likes going for that up B to just catch that sort of uh, basic double jump in towards the stage. That's kind of how we'll always space it, is to catch that specific double jump. Could have maybe gotten the kill there if he threw out a downer, but wasn't ready for it I guess. Gets the backer though, this should be an easy edge guard on Fox, and he misses. Probably just thought uh, Fox wasn't going to quite go that far and he could cover things with the down tilt, but I think he needed a short hop there there. <clears throat> and uh, yeah, Nikki looking like uh, <laughs> like they're going to double jump into an up B again, unfortunately, and Closin is going to take that one with a 2-0. Um, I'm going to say... If I had to guess, Nikki's probably a newer player. Uh, it's something to work on would be just like practicing like Z cancels and being able to pick up punishes because like did some good stuff in neutral and like landed the aerials. Uh, but then you know if you miss the Z cancel, you don't get anything more off of it. And when you're fighting Kirby, you gotta like hit the move and then hit him again a bunch of times and kill him. Because if you don't do that, it's just like an impossible matchup. <laughs> 